What's up, y'all? I got my half broken chair. Hope I don't fall out of it. It actually feels pretty comfortable to me. Uh, welcome to the channel. Uh, Ready Night Boy here. I want to take time because this is my first Q&A and literally I just woke up around 11.37 I didn't get to bed till 4.37 a.m. so uh, I'm trying to think of the things to talk about one is um, Roman Atwood I've been watching your videos since I can't remember. It's been I guess it's been that long. I've been watching all your videos and everything. And uh you get me to smile a lot. You get me to laugh a lot in all your videos. Thumbs up. Um I don't want to talk about the past. I just want to leave the past in the past. This is the new year, so I'm going to talk something about something new. Um, I am officially single again. I'm pretty sure you guys seen the videos of what I said. And, uh,. Roxy, what are you doing? Come here. Come here. My baby girl. Come here. She's a good girl. Pitbull. Blue nose. Full. Full blow. Full blue nose pit. She's a female. She's kind of like Roxy. Leave her alone. I even also got a cat, and she likes to chase the cat around. But the cat is just—I don't know. I got the cat for Christmas. Her name is Babies. I got the cat for I got the cat for my mom for Christmas and uh ever since I got her the cat likes to follow me around instead of my mom so basically it's my cat but um you you guys I'm I don't know what I'm trying to make here. I don't know what I'm trying to say. This is my first Q&A. Um, hopefully things will turn out right for me and my mom. I know my brother's doing good. He moved out. He he's only seventeen, guys, and he 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 already moved out, and he's got himself a good job and everything. And uh, I'm stuck here, like with nothing. All I have is my dogs, my cat. A broken down vehicle. I mean, it's got a full tank, and but there's only one problem with it. There's it's the um the um 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 we call it 
the power steering pump wheel, the pulley or whatever you want to call it, is bent. So, um, yeah, every time I put the belt on and get a jump started, it just comes right off. That's the only problem with it. So, basically, we have no vehicle. All I have is just my mom and my dogs and a house and property. That's all I have. I only have two friends. Two. Just two. That's it. Um, always think positive, never think negative, because that's what I did when I was 16 and 17 years old. I always thought negative, and what it did is got me in a lot of trouble. So, this is 2017, I'm 19 years old, and... I'm trying to think more positive because if you think more positive good things happen if you think negative bad things happen you always gotta think that um, at, at least try to stay positive I know some of you guys out there are like, oh, I don't care, and stuff like that, but me, I'm just a country boy. I like to do crazy things. I like to blow up things and uh, spend time with my family and, well, basically my mom. That's all I have left. And I can't lose her. Because I don't know what I would do if I lose her. So, um. It's, it's pretty nice day out. I'm in Florida. It is. Sixty-nine degrees out. Sixty-nine degrees out. Last night it was thirty-nine. For the first time it was thirty-nine degrees here in Florida. It was so cold in my house that I literally had to turn on my stove. Um... I had my stove up to 450 degrees to warm up the whole house, but it is so hard because you got these vents on these floors that are, are I don't got the air ducts connected. Oh, I'm still tired. And when it's that cold, the cold comes through the vents and it gets really cold in the house. So I had the stove on. But I never thought of blocking off the vents. I never thought of that. Like laying stuff over it to keep the house warm. But uh. I'm trying to entertain you guys. I'm trying to you know. You know. You guys want me to do something, put it in the comments. Comment below what you guys want me to do. And I'll try my best to do it. I know I got some followers and I got some uh, people that are watching my videos, but that's not the point though. The point is, is that um, I gotta, I'm starting a new life here. 
everything I did wrong, I'm, I'm leaving that in the past. I'm moving on. So, you know, you got to do what you got to do. Leave all the negative and all the bad things and the past that happened to you in the past. Leave it in 2016, guys. Leave it in 2016. Start new. Start your life new in 2017. And that's what I'm doing. I'm starting new. I'm trying to uh, do more videos for you guys. I'm trying to do more things for you guys. You know, I'm trying to do more entertaining and having fun and doing all this and that for you guys. But there's literally nothing to do around here. I have... A big pit fire pit that's full that I can't get burnt down I got a boat sitting right here with no motor in it it's just a shell in the trailer with trash in it you know it's just my well, whole yard is a mess and I have a really bad back it's just really hard for me to clamp my whole yard myself and I got big piles of mulch in my yard in my driveway it's just because I've been in a car accident in 2015 or 16 I believe it was in 16 Cause I met a girl in 2015 and we all went out to Frogger's we ate and had fun played pool had you know talked you know and we we're having some family issues and then we tried coming back home and then some lady was going about 50 miles an hour she hit us from behind hit my mom's ex-boyfriend from behind and then he hit us and there's no damage except for dents on, on the back of the bumper and his whole car got smashed it was just a whole mess I got out, I was pissed off, I didn't know where I was thinking, and I went to go check on the person that caused the accident, and it was an old lady, and she's admitting to the car accident, and I wasn't wearing a seatbelt, you know, I wasn't thinking, I was trying to hurry and get home, I was in the back seat. And she hit him, he hit us, and then I went flying towards the front, and I got pretty messed up. That's what happens when you don't wear a seatbelt. So guys out there, everybody out there, please wear a seatbelt or either that, get a ticket, and go to jail. So for now on, I'm going to be wearing seatbelts because I'm only 19 years old. I still got a whole life ahead of me. I'm trying to find someone that's good for me and wants to do the same things that I'll, I want to do. And I want to have a family and stuff. I don't want to not sit here and not wear a seatbelt and then have it, and end up having a car accident and then go and fly into the windshield and die. That's not me. I learned my lesson from the car accident. So that was in the past. So now I'm starting new. I'm trying to get up every morning. Every morning, it's really hard for me to get up early in the mornings because I'm always watching Roman Atwood. I'm always watching his videos nonstop. His pranks, his daily vlogs, everything. Everything that he does, I watch him and then he's always positive he's always telling people to be positive um, always smile more always smile more that he, he even he's even running a store called smile more everybody um, 
show some love to him, like him, subscribe to him. He's pretty much changing my life right now. Every time I watch his videos, it's always something new. Roxy, get over here. So, I don't know what you guys want me to do. You guys tell me in the comments what you guys want me to do. I'll do anything. I'm out in, I'm out in the country. So, pretty much I can do anything on my own and on my property. I mean, I can't sit here and put grenades and, and, and mortars and something really big and explode it because... I got neighbors around here. I mean, I do got, I do got a gun. I do got things around here that I can blow up. But my thing is, is that I'm trying to tell you guys, I messed up in the past, and I'm starting new. And. Let's see where else. Huh. Oh, about the the car accident. I'm waiting on my settlement. I am getting settlement, and we are suing the lady because I, I got really messed up in the back. So hopefully, when that comes, I'm gonna end up fixing up the house that we're staying in now, and I'm gonna end up buying some couple new things and invest the money, you know. Um. That way, when I have the money, I can entertain you guys more. But right now, I don't have anything right now. I'm, like, trying to survive off of no money, no vehicle, barely anything. And I'm, I'm, I'm doing pretty good. I don't... <laughs> it's kind of funny. I don't get to bed until, like, usually... One, two, three, four, maybe five o'clock in the morning because I'm always watching Roman Atwood. I'm always watching his videos every time. It's like non ending videos. I'm trying to find the very, 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 very first video that he made and it's just never ending. I keep scrolling down and down and down and down and I just can't find it. It's never ending. And it's just like. When he. When. When he started his YouTube. He. I heard that you can get paid from. Doing YouTube videos. And stuff like that. But I'm not money hungry. I'm not like that. I'm nothing like that. I, I just want to do videos, that's my thing, is do videos, entertain you guys, and you guys tell me in the comments what you guys want me to do, and I'll do it. And, um, it feels hotter than 69 degrees out. It's windy but hot. It's pretty it's a pretty nice day out. Um Always love your family. Always love your family because I even watch Angry Grandpa. And I seen 
two of his videos, but usually I stopped watching them because they started getting boring. Because they never do anything like Roman Outwood does. Roman Outwood, he does his activities. He has, he has a family. He does fun things and stuff like that. But And it's always positive. But when I watch Angry Grandpa, it's always like negative And he's always angry about little things. And it's just... It's in a kind of way, it's kind of funny, and another way, it ain't because it's negative. And it's always depression, and they never do anything. It's always going to see him or do this or do that. So that's why I unscribe them and dislike them because it's all about depression and negativity. Negative. It's always negative. They never do anything like Roman Atwood does. So I keep watching Roman Atwood. Roman Atwood is my fan. And I'm trying not to do anything that he does because it's... I don't know. So I'm doing my own thing. This is my first q and I'm trying my best. Always love your family because when I watched Angry Grandpa, he lost his sister. He lost his dad, and he lost his mom. And uh, they always fight, they always argue, and um, they all passed away. They all died, and uh, he still loves them, even though he fought and argued and this and that with him. Here, I just got my mom, my brother moved. He doesn't, my brother doesn't even contact me. He doesn't even text me. He doesn't even call me. He doesn't even do nothing. It's because he's always busy. He's always working. He's got a, he's working at a real, real mechanic shop. He's still got a girl. There's, he's still young and he's living with our cousin. Me, I'm sitting here doing this with no job. I'm on disability. I'm not gonna go there because I'm not ready for that sometime in the point later soon whatever I will but right now it's not a good time I'm trying to uh, do my first Q&A and it's 23 minutes long uh, so yeah, you guys stay positive, do what you guys want to do, but just stay out of trouble, love your family, love your friends, give a big shout out, and subscribe, and like, and show some love to Roman Atwood, um, even subscribe to me, Com put some comments in, tell me what y'all want me to do, and I'll do it, something that you guys want to see, something you guys never see me do before something that you guys can't do and I can do or whatever just put it in the comments subscribe to me I always try my best to keep you guys entertained and have fun make you guys laugh and this and that so um if you guys you know want me to blow up something put it in the comments what do you guys want me to blow up if you guys want me to shoot something put it in the comments tell me exactly what you guys want me to shoot and cause all I got is a modified choke 12 gauge that was my grandfather's and He moved out. He moved to I think it's Michigan or I'm thinking it's Michigan or Mississippi. Either of those two. He left 
everything behind. Even the guns, his electronics, his computers, and everything. All he took is his computer, a little bit of things, and that was it. He left. So, I got the gun, my brother got his other gun, and I'm trying to get another gun, but the most important thing is that I need a laptop. I need a new laptop, because the one I have is running very slow, I can't figure out um, how to manufacture or how to get it to run faster, I can't, you know, I'm, I'm, not the type of guy that is into computers but I love electronics phones xboxes game systems TVs stereo systems even car audio systems I had two CBR 12s in the back of a blazer and I was running 760 watts and they both had their own channel and I got rid of those for um, what did I get rid of those for? Oh, I got rid of those for a handgun. But I got rid of the handgun because it wasn't registered to me and it wasn't in my name I didn't have concealed so I got rid of it I gave it back and I told him you know what just keep the speakers but that was my bad mistake but you know what I don't want to talk about it because right now the most most important thing is, is that we need a new vehicle we need a new vehicle we need something that has no problems know nothing with it so like I'm saying again love your family love your friends show some love to Roman Atwood on YouTube subscribe to him like him watch all his videos and you guys will know what I'm trying to say and what I'm trying to explain to you guys um, Comment below what you guys want me to do to entertain and make you guys have fun and watch all my videos. Please like, subscribe, comment, and share these videos, my videos. And don't forget to put a comment in below what you guys want me to do to entertain, make you guys have fun, and laugh and all about my videos. Thanks for watching. Redneck Boy out. Peace.